Hi everyone, my name is Daksa Vigunasekara, you can call me Ducky for short. I am Revolve's engineering manager and today I would like to take the opportunity to share with you a little bit about our, one of our high voltage products. Uh, this is a modularly built 100 kilowatt hour high voltage system. The entire system is a 220 amp hour, 460.8 volt nominal system. In total, that comes up to 100 kilowatt hours in terms of storage. Um, each one of these battery, sorry, this entire battery string rather, is comprised of individual battery modules. Um, this is built in a modular fashion for easy assembly on site. Um, and each battery module consists of a single pack of LFP cells, all of which combine together to form the entire high voltage battery string. Each pack is governed by a battery management module, a BMM, which is on the front of each uh, battery pack. Um, and you'll see that all of them are connected in a series configuration to create the high voltage string. Each BMM is connected together in a CAN common bus, which connects all the way through and forms part of the communication system between all of the battery packs. Furthermore, we've got a maintenance breaker which is built into the string. Um, it's used to isolate the high voltage lithium from the PDU box. Um, this is specifically for maintenance conditions whereby if a Revolve battery technician or someone would like to work on the high voltage string or wants to swap a pack out or something along the lines of this, they use the maintenance breaker to isolate so that it's safe to work on. The maintenance breaker leads onto the PDU, the power distribution unit, which is responsible for the switching part of the high voltage system. Collectively, the BMMs as well as the PDU, as well as a little bit of intelligent control circuitry, form the BMS part of the um, high voltage system. Behind me on this panel is where most of the control circuitry is stored um, and it has a easily accessible emergency stop in case uh, emergency or safety condition um, happens in the field, some sort of incident. A uh, user can easily turn this system to a non-live state. Uh, furthermore, we have some easily viewable uh, user LEDs which show the current operation of the system. As we can see right now, the system is in a fully operational state um, indicated by the solid green light. Um, and furthermore, behind this, we've got some of our Reeve of RCs which are responsible for control of the system as well as remote monitoring of the system itself. There are some additional breakers which are used to turn that control circuitry on and off. Um, and collectively, um, everything I've described, along with the lithium packs themselves, um, forms the basis of this 100 kilowatt hour Revolve system. This is a Revolve RC. This forms a very integral part of all of our high voltage systems. It is also a product that we built with low voltage in mind, um, but we're here to talk about the high voltage component of it. The RC um, forms the part of a distributed computing model, if I could call it that way, inside each one of our high voltage systems. Every high voltage system comes equipped with two of these units, one of which is used to monitor the specific strings information. So in this case, that would monitor this individual string. Um, and then there would be a secondary master, which would be used to consolidate multiple strings of information. So if you had, for example, three of these 100 kilowatt hour systems running together, you would simply use one master. The Revolve RC generates a access point, which anyone can connect to via a computer, a mobile phone, anything of that sort. And it can be used to monitor specific battery information and control information on a local platform. Um, this is that platform over here um, and you will be able to see on a localized system very in-depth details such as the status of each individual relay um, as well as in-depth battery information on a per cell basis um, on each of the packs that are inside the high voltage system. Um, you'd also be able to see most information such as temperatures, the current status, the pack's voltage, um, the current that's flowing through the system, and so on. Um, this is very much a local access point. Um, this 
is connected to all to one of our products called the RRM system, Revolve's Remote Monitoring System, which is on this laptop over here. Revolve's RRM is a remote monitoring system built for monitoring Revolve's batteries. Um, all of our high voltage systems come by default equipped with this functionality um, and it can be used anywhere with certain tiers of access in order to permit end users, installers, as well as super users, different levels of access depending on what the need is on that system. Um, you would be able to view individual metrics with regards to per cell information, view connected strings, uh, the inverter information, as well as a fair amount of control over the individual battery strings themselves. Uh, this was created specifically with the African continent in mind, simply because it's a very large country and it takes quite a while to drive to places. Um, the ability for viewing of remote information as well as changing parameters that are relevant in that installation is seen as something fundamental um, in most of these systems as they tend to be deployed in very remote locations. Revolve's RRM, Remote Monitoring, as well as the RCs are part of a built engineered ecosystem, um, specifically included in our high voltage batteries, which allows incredible functionality with regards to monitoring, altering, setting parameters of individual battery strings all remotely. Um, this allows both the installers, the end users, as well as Revolve's technicians in case of faults to be able to diagnose and help fix repairs so that downtime is very limited. Um, in total, we hope that this entire ecosystem that has been built for Revolve High Voltage will be an excellent addition to, to South Africa's market for that matter. Um, and we hope your usage of the product is enjoyable.